kind of getting prepared. I'm going to do a uh, short little bike ride from uh, Flagstaff, Arizona down to Payson, about 90 miles, 100 miles, give or take. Uh, it's a little late in the day, it's about noon. So, I think I woke up a little late, but uh, it should be, a, it should be a, a good trip. There's It's kind of cold out still. It's, uh, I think it's April 3rd or something, but uh, yeah, it's still kind of chilly out, nice little wind, but I'll warm up on the trail and I'll definitely let y'all know what it's about. It's kind of a fun little ride. I'll uh, hopefully get some cool, uh, cool pictures and uh, we'll see you on the road. All right, I'm in beautiful Flagstaff, Arizona. Just ready to head south towards uh, Payson and then down to Phoenix. Probably stop at Payson, but anyway, I just want to show you how beautiful what beautiful amenities we have here in Flagstaff. Uh, let's see. There we go. You gotta have Walmart. It's a staple of American society. So, uh, also here in Flagstaff, we, uh, we really enjoy our waterways and we, uh, we really find them beautiful and, uh, we take care of them and you know they're kind of a staple of our society so I'd just like to show you the beautiful river we have running through town it's called the Rio de Flag beautiful river just just look how wonderful oh yeah isn't that pretty oh imagine the beautiful trout that live in there what a gorgeous town gorgeous oh there's the highway too yeah it's always fun so yeah, one of the uh, cooler places uh, up here in Flagstaff is Lake Mary. Uh, it's about 15, 20 miles outside of town. I mean, it's not really a lake, it's a reservoir, but it's really the only decent body of water around. So yeah. Fairly big, you know, nothing special. But that's gonna be my last source of water for a while. I mean, there's runoff. <clears throat> I gotta go about 85 more miles, and there's runoff, but there's no more lakes along the way. All right, so I've done 30.2 miles today. And I'm done. I haven't been on a bike in a year. I'm absolutely, my legs are like jello. They're killing me. Uh, it's windy as all hell. I made it out to Mormon Lake, which is 30 miles out of Flagstaff South. And it's really just a dried up, uh, dried up lake bed that fills up in the winter. So um, that's kind of it down there. And I'm debating whether I should just camp out here or push my I don't know or push my bike further. Really, I don't have a choice because I'm exhausted. I'm beat. I just can't ride anymore. I know it's kind of wussy uh, ending at 30 miles, but man, first days they're killer. They get you every time. So I'm gonna walk down there see if there's anywhere to pitch my tent and it doesn't look like there is but I guess I'll find out I'm actually not gonna do that I can't hike all my stuff all the way down there there's not like a trail it's just pure rock and it's a good quarter mile I don't know what I was thinking I just like to be next to water and being in Arizona there's no water anywhere shit uh, I think I'm just going to ride down the road a little bit more towards the village of Mormon uh, Lake. Maybe I'll find something over that way. Well, well, well. This is it. Uh, I got snow. I can melt. Uh, I got a little bit of tree cover here for the wind. I see some loose wood around that's uh, 
looks dry, so this is where I'm camping. Not too bad. I hope you can't you camp here, wouldn't you? Alright, so I built a little TP type of uh, fire there. Hopefully it'll work. Got a little stash of firewood there. Got my tent, my bike's over here. And uh, I'm looking around, you know, for firewood. Right across the way from me is a perfect campsite with logs, a huge fire pit, <laughs> about 50 yards away after I've set everything up. Big old logs that'll burn all night. I mean, it's good to have a fire going to keep animals away, and that's just a perfect campsite over there. I didn't even see it. Hey, you think I can get this to light on my first try? Let's see. I bet I can. There we go. Oh, I rubbed two sticks together and made a lighter. I was trying to trying to tell a joke there, but I'm not that funny. <sighs> Come on. Come on, baby. Will it stay lit? That's the trick. So yeah, in case you're wondering what I eat. There you go. Mountain house, baby. Actually, this is Backpacker's Pantry, which is... Oh, well, it's... I think it's better than Mountain House, to tell you the truth. But they're both uh, freeze-dried food. Just add water, heat it up. This is garlic herb and mashed potatoes. I got a bunch of other stuff, but... It's all a mountain house, and I've had I've eaten that so much, I'm just sick of it. So, yeah, I just, I have a little mess kit type of deal that I heat up the water in, and then I use this. It's just a butane daily dally. But, of course, I forgot a spoon, a fork, I don't have anything to eat with. So, I think I'm going to have to whittle something out of a piece of wood, or, I don't know. Eat with my fingers. Alrighty, well, it's bedtime. In the can, I'm in the tent, and it's about 7:30. About my bedtime. I'm all snuggled up. I got my. Uh, it's a new Eureka Spitfire tent, and I have a North Face bag with a fleece liner, just for extra, you know, extra warmth. It's probably going to be too hot, but I didn't want to freeze. So. Morning. Oh, my knee is killing me. All right, so I'm here at the uh, Mormon Lake Village. Uh, it's out here by Flagstaff, about six miles from where I camped. Uh, it's still windy as hell. I don't know what I'm gonna do, but I just thought I'd show you this town. It's small, you know, just like a summer town. Not even a gas station here, but uh, here's Main Street. Kind of a uh... all right. <clears throat> Had to push my bike up this hill here. <sighs> Still trucking. You know, I lost my iPod. Misplaced it. Don't know where it's at. So I'm listening to an AM/FM radio little player here. Only station I get is Top 40. If I hear another Auto Tune song. I'm going to take my bike and ride it into oncoming traffic. It's driving me nuts. I wonder music sucks these days. Well, I made it to Happy Jack. Uh, let's see. I've gone 67.59 miles in 7 hours 52 minutes and 22 seconds. 